In January, we brought you the exciting news that Gilead Sciences had acquired a groundbreaking HIV therapeutic vaccine developed in Spain. Since then, major updates have emerged from a phase two clinical trial, and today, we're breaking it all down. Stick around, because this could be a huge leap forward in the search for an HIV cure. Welcome back. Now, let's quickly recap the essentials. The HTI vaccine short for Hyvacat T-cell immunogenesis, not like traditional preventative vaccines. It's a therapeutic vaccine designed specifically for people living with HIV to help their immune systems control the virus without relying on daily antiretroviral therapy. Imagine an HIV treatment that could eventually free patients from a lifetime of medication. That's the promise here. Originally developed at Ercicacia in collaboration with Spain's Fight Infections Foundation and several leading hospitals, the HTI vaccine has been in development for years. Gilead's acquisition in late 2024 was a significant signal that they believe in this technology. And now, new data from the Phase II trial, known as ALIX-003, confirms this vaccine's potential. Now on to the latest update, the Phase II clinical trial. This study, conducted across nine major hospitals in Spain, including Hospital Germans Trias y Pujo, Hospital La Paz, and several others, enrolled 50 participants. These were HIV-positive individuals who had started treatment early and achieved undetectable viral loads before the trial. The participants received the HTI vaccine in combination with an immune-modulating drug called Vesitolimod. Vesitolimod is designed to boost the immune response further, making the vaccine's effects even more pronounced. The trial's findings are encouraging. First, the combination therapy proved to be completely safano major adverse effects were reported. More importantly, the treatment generated a robust immune response. In simple terms, the body's T cells were better trained to recognize and attack HIV infected cells. After receiving the treatment, participants underwent a supervised interruption of their antiretroviral therapy, ART, a critical step to test if their immune system could hold the virus in check. While all patients experienced some viral rebound, a compelling statistic emerged. 33.3% of those treated maintained significantly lower viral loads during the interruption, compared to 23.5% in the control group. This nearly 10% improvement is more than just a number. It's evidence that the vaccine is actively retraining the immune system, much like switching from a shotgun approach to a precise sniper shot against HIV. So, why is the HTI vaccine so special? According to researchers, including Dr. Beatriz Moth and principal investigator Dr. Christian Brander, the vaccine targets specific, vulnerable regions of the HIV virus. By focusing the immune response on these critical points, the vaccine helps the body control HIV, even without continuous medication. The trial also evaluated a simplified vaccination regimen. This means fewer doses are needed, which could translate into easier, more cost-effective treatment if approved on a large scale. The collaboration between nine hospitals in Spain provided robust data, enhancing the reliability of these encouraging results. For the millions of people living with HIV, these results represent a beacon of hope. If future trials confirm these findings, we might see a shift from daily medication to a treatment strategy that allows for a period of drug-free control of the virus. This isn't just about convenience, it's about improving quality of life by reducing side effects and treatment fatigue. Moreover, the HTI vaccine could eventually be combined with other advanced therapies, such as broadly neutralizing antibodies or even gene therapies, forming part of a multi-pronged approach to achieving a functional cure. 
Gilead Sciences' strategic acquisition of the HTI vaccine assets is more than a business move, it's a commitment to transforming HIV treatment. With Gilead's considerable resources and expertise, we can expect accelerated research, larger trials, and, hopefully, faster regulatory approval down the road. Looking ahead, further studies will explore long-term efficacy and the potential for combining this vaccine with other therapeutic approaches. These expanded trials will be critical in establishing whether the HTI vaccine can truly deliver a drug-free functional cure for HIV. This isn't the end. It's only the beginning of a promising new chapter in HIV research. If you found this update informative, please like and share this video. Subscribe for more updates on groundbreaking medical research and leave your thoughts in the comments below. And remember, if you missed our previous video on Gilead's acquisition of the HTI vaccine back in January, check that out too on the top right-hand corner of the screen for the full backstory. Stay tuned as we continue to track these developments that could one day lead to an HIV cure. And if you want to stay up to date with every breakthrough in HIV science and treatment, hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and share this video with friends and family.